What is up, everyone? Sorry about that. What is up, everyone? My name is Cody Campbell, and welcome back to another StarCraft 2 Legacy of the Void playthrough. Last video, we literally blew up a planet, so we're ready to head out to the next destination. to construction of the Zelnaga now. They're understanding that energy, essence, and information are all one. Each interchangeable, each mutable. Then you uncovered the information Zeratul foresaw within this keystone. I have. From what I understand, it will lead us to Ulnar. Ulnar? It is a place of myth. A realm whispered of in our legends. The homeworld of the Zelnaga. I believe the Keystone can project its location. Show me, Karax. survive within such unrelenting forces. It appears I have failed you, Hierarch. I do not believe so, Karax. It is said that the Zelnaga came from a place where no life should be. This aligns with Zeratul's prophecies. We will go in. Make preparations at once. thought you mad, and yet, once more, you have seen truer than us all. The Keystone leads us into the Altarian Rift, to the Zelnaga home of Ulnar. It is my destiny to carry your mantle, old friend. I will wake the Zelnaga and honor your legacy. All right. It is hard to believe we stand above Ulnar, the home of the Ihan Ri, the Zelnaga. The Judicators theorized the Zelnaga left Ayr to return to a place such as this. It is said they slumbered through the ages. Zeratul believed the artifact would lead us unto hope. The Zelnaga may be the hope he spoke of. If the legends are true, then the Zelnaga are below awaiting their children to awaken them. Then let us hope so. How Zeratul foresaw the Keystone would lead us here is uncanny. It is now clear that it was this device's primary purpose. Zeratul was in touch with an expression of reality beyond my understanding. This place should not exist. It defies all decrees of science, shatters all understanding of astral mechanics. I once thought we Protoss had reached the pinnacle of attainable knowledge. 
I was a fool. There is far more in the galaxy than exists within Protoss' understanding, friend Carax. I know this now. I pondered the events that brought me here. There is much I should remember, but do not. My body is machine, like the purifiers. But you are not like them. I must know the truth of what I am. What you will uncover may not be desirable. It is time I face that. The ship's data center has uploaded the recent annals and has much of the history you have lost. I hope you find the answers you seek, friend Phoenix. All right, let's begin. Hierarch. It appears we cannot receive transmissions while we are within the rift. We have been cut off. The Spear of Adun's sensors have located what appears to be an access way into the temple. Our starships are prepared to move on your command. midnight as I'm recording this. Here lies the resting place of the Zelnaga. We must find a way to unseal this access way if we are to awaken them. Grand Preserver, what do you know of the temple in the depths below? Only myth, legend. Here upon Olnar, the destined races will seek ascension. Their very presence shall open the way forward. I believe these celestial locks are the key. Our forces should claim them in the hopes the way forward presents itself. Hyrock, the Taldorim are here. They are taking control of the Celestial Locks. Stargates can now warp in Phoenixes. They are extremely mobile and effective at engaging our enemy across long distances.
That's the things. forces are inbound to our nexus point. Zirovec, time for battle. I didn't know that. Hierarch, the Tal'Darim have deployed a titanic warp prism. If its core is similar to our own, the reactor is made of pure solarite. If possible, we should destroy it and claim the reactor to enhance our solar core. You have not enough. I am here in the shadows. Philip, successful. You have not enough minerals. Upgrade complete. Vespine gas. Teleport successful. Successful. You have not enough minerals. Upgrade complete.
Upgrade complete. Upgrade complete. Upgrade complete. You require more Vespin gas. Our pylon is under attack. Amon's forces have been defeated. Our warrior's presence should allow us to lay claim to the lock. The lock is now ours. These energy patterns indicate once we control the other four, the temple will open.
successful. Teleport successful. Pull back from the enemy base. We must focus on the celestial locks. It shall be as you say. Very well. We move unseen. are moving to seize a lock. Another lock in enemy hands. Amon's forces are in a defensive position. Skies and wind. Not so scared. the enemy. Oh, 
One poor call. Understood. Your probes are under attack. Sorry, the, the damn mouse. The damn mouse is just being stupid. a lock has fallen to the enemy. We will need to retake it quickly. Skills. 
And that face just too strong for me. Uh, we are one with the shadows. Yeah, uh, I, I found a realization I cannot I cannot beat that base. because obviously it's it's too long of a video to be I'd be here all night just trying to destroy that base I, I bet it is possible just jump use a bunch of units and just tear up the place Idea where we're gonna, where it's gonna put me. We are one with the shadows. Servants are moving to seize a lock. Very wise. Let our enemy know our fury. For the reckoning. We move unseen.
must construct additional pylons. I am here in the shadows. It is done. I am warping the vessel's cargo aboard for further study. Five locks have been captured, Hierarch. The access way is opening. It seems Amon's forces have drawn back. I sense only a great stillness from within the temple. Then we have succeeded. It will not be long before we see what fate has in store for us. I'm afraid the Spear of Adun will not be able to assist you inside the temple. Please be careful, Hierarch. Amon's forces arrived here before we did. The temple may already be under his control. Zeratul believed the other Zelnaga were here, and that they would stand with us against Amon. They could end the war. My people could be free once again. Then why have the Zelnaga not answered us? I am going into the Ulnar Temple alone, Matriarch. I do not intend to risk any more lives. You risk your own life on the word of a traitor. He killed your mother, Vorazun. That is true. But he was never a traitor. I do not wish for death. Only to see Zeratul's visions fulfilled. You will return. That much, I believe. Yes. 
Since we arrived here, the Keystone has reacted strangely. It's as if it is attuned to the energies below. Energies below? Yes. Void energies exude from this place. I believe this world is a conduit between dimensions. And the Keystone? Acts as if siphoning these energies. This is entirely different from how the origin point information was stored. As if the Keystone was reconfigured for a second purpose. Let us hope that the Zelnaga themselves can reveal the truths you're looking for. Hey, uh, if I can't use my abilities... aid me in the battle ahead. This burden is mine to bear. The Starfighters have arrived, and they await your evaluation. It is a good day to die. The skies await. May Rashagal light the path to victory. Adun Toridas, Hyrak. Borazun, I know not what I shall find below, but I know I must go alone. You are in command of the Spear of Adun now. Until you return, Artemis. All right. I have come seeking the Zelnog.
It seems fate has drawn us together. You should not attempt it further. The shrines call this place the Temple of Unification. The Zelnaga are somewhere within. Far all I've encountered are hybrid. I've been fighting them for days. Progress has been difficult. The prophecies foretell of two ascended races working together to seek out the halls of revelation within the temple. Only with both present will the shrines reveal the means to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. I've never cared much for prophecy. And yet, despite our history, here we stand, together. Perhaps you should start. You have... Let us make for the shrine. Change is upon us. Dawn will come. There can be no doubt. Speak. Our destiny awaits. It seems the temple has guardians. I will deal with them. Together, we are strong. Strength. Halt! Do you sense that? A great power awakens within this construct. Purity of form. Purity of essence. Prove your strength. Stay close to me, Kerrigan. My psionic abilities can mend our wounds. So the constructs hold the keys. Good to know. Let us proceed. Unity. There can be no doubt. These devices emit solar energy. We should gather them. Our knowledge is your heritage. The future is ours. Look out! Hybrid! Yes. We shall prevail. Our limits are Ark and Vyash. There can be another construct. We'll have to destroy it to open the doorway. I serve my dream. What is it already? Change is upon us. We shall prevail. Together, we are strong. A key is still missing. There is a powerful energy across this chasm. Kerrigan, remain here. I must investigate this. Dawn will come. Kerrigan, the construct is coming for you! Yes. Oh. I serve my... Strength in unity. Your queen. Change is upon us. Arak and Vyash. With honor, I lead. Our destiny awaits. Fate is with us. The shrine still functions. power. It should be active shortly. Friends of yours? Not quite. It appears Amon's forces have found a way into the temple. We must slay them all. 
think I'm starting to like you, Artanis. Your queen listens. Speak. What is it already? Your queen listens. You have my attention. We shall prevail. Yes. I serve my people. Make it quick. Change is upon us. Together, we are strong. Let's finish this. Then we can see what your shrine has to say. Barak and Vyash. Zelnaga were the first, born within the void. Their sacred purpose was to cultivate life and perpetuate the infinite cycle. At a new universe's creation, they take a physical form. If destroyed, they are thrust back into the void. All of this time, they have waited for us to assemble the Keystone and find our way here. Amon indwells my people, possessing them through the Kala. But he has no physical form. If he were separated from the Templar, he could be forced back into the Void. Come on, Artanis. We've still got a long way to go. What is it already? Let's go. It won't be long until our enemy pushes further into the temple. It seems you were correct. Well then, shall we? Arak and Vyash. Your queen, listen to me. Our destiny awaits. Have my attention. Strength and unity. The future, I serve my people. Speak. Change is upon us. Arak and Vyash. Yes. Our destiny awaits. Together, we are strong. Make it quick. Your queen. We shall prevail. There can be no doubt. The passage has caved in. We must find another way forward. It appears the Taldarim are preoccupied. We should engage them while they are fighting the constructs. You have my attention. Strength in unity. Together, we are strong. Change is upon us. A bold plan. With honor, I lead. The future. What fools you are to attack me. Speak. Dawn will come. Together, we are strong. This passage has caved in as well. Wait. Hybrid. I serve my people. Arak and Vyash. A bold plan. Alnar shall serve as your tomb. Strength in unity. Together, we are strong. They're fighting another construct. 
your queen. Change is upon us. I serve my people. There can be no doubt. Our path is clear. Dawn will come. Yes. Our heritage is your future. The future is ours. Together, we are strong. The Taldarim are breaching into the Hall of Revelation. Ready your blades, Templar. I am. Our destiny awaits. Stand with me. Your queen listens. Arach and Vyash. Change is upon us. What is it? Dawn will come. Explain yourself. Looks like we've earned a breather. You're up, Artanis. Make it quick. The shrines look like they're covered with pictograms. How do you know what they say? Communing with the shrine is more than reading carvings. Each atom of the stone has been placed with meaning. Purpose. It was here, from Alnar, that the Zelnaga began to seed the universe with life. They created us, just as they gave life to a numberless assembly of races in other universes. Every time. They observe and identify the potential of their offspring, never interfering. The infinite cycle will always be the same. Two races are destined to emerge. One, pure of essence, an indomitable spirit capable of great change. And one, pure of form, a being capable of vast psionic potential, able to house the essence of a Zelnaga. Purity of essence and form, the Zerg and the Protoss. But if the Zelnaga do not interfere, then it was Amon who uplifted my people. All we thought was the Zelnaga was a lie. Come on, Artanis. We're not far from having some answers. I believe this must be the final hall. Wait. The doors are open. The constructs destroyed. The shrine is under attack! This can only be the work of a one. We delay no longer. Our salvation will not be stolen from us. Our destiny awaits. Let's get to that shrine. Our path is clear. What is it already? In unity. Your queen is Change is upon us. Arak and Vyash. Explain yourself. 
Attention. We shall prevail. Our destiny awaits us. For Zeratul! For Aya! Only darkness awaits Shrine thing, Artanis. These gods of yours have a lot to answer for. Ahead of us, within the Chamber of Ascension, the Zelnaga have slumbered as civilizations grew fell and formed again they will awaken when the two destined races arrive then the elders among them will give their lives to bestow their essence and pure of form and pure of essence will be reborn as zelnaga shepherds of the infinite cycle Something's not right here.
not so easily broken, Amon. The firstborn shall fear you no longer! Matriarch, there is a massive output of void energy spiking from the temple below. Target the epicenter. Us fools? Yes, but that is irrelevant. What is relevant is that Amon has opened a gateway to the void. Dark energies pour from within, and they will burn through your precious leader and any who oppose Amon. I can guide you to Artanas before this fate befalls him. If we are bold, we can stop the Dark God's assault. Am I to believe that the moment you're released, your blade will not be in my back? You waste time. Lower your blades. I am Alarak, first descendant of the Taldarim. Amon has betrayed my people. Retribution will be claimed for this, and if your hierarch survives, he will aid in it. Make your decision. You will take us to Artanis. Most wise. I have brought an additional defensive ability online, Matriarch. Please visit the Solar Core to configure it. If you heed my words, your Hierarch will live. Rohana. Rohana! You sought honor, and now you have found it. The cradle of life, both your beginning and your end. Release her, Amon. Do you seek deliverance within these empty halls? You will find none here. Only the truth of the Zelnaga's failure. Let. Her. Go! I offer a gift. Release in oblivion. Silence! <laughs> Matriarch, the Keystone has begun absorbing void energies at an unprecedented rate. Then this Taldarim speaks the truth. Void energies flood from the temple. With each passing moment, the threat grows. I do not trust him, but all data points to the scenario he describes. A gateway to the void has been opened. Is there any way to pinpoint Artanis? No. The energies are making us virtually blind. We must put our faith in this Taldarim. It pains me to do so. Alright, um...
This Taldarim has brought warriors with him. Perhaps there is a benefit to his presence after all. Where shall we march? I am Ritter. I am here. Where does my prey hide? This path will lead your forces to Artanis. I have done as I promised, Dark Templar. Now go tell your Hierarch. I am waiting for him. Matriarch, our High Templar have volunteered to aid you. The loss of the Kala was not easily borne. But we are ready to serve once again. Templar, I thank you for your bravery in this dire time. We will recover our Hierarch. The darkness, our spirit. We are focused once more. Unleash psionic storms, brothers. Let these hybrid thralls feel the wrath of the Templar. Rodas! Coming! Unity through purpose. We continue. I have heard of these Terran Spectres. Focus their energies into a feedback loop. They will not bear it. We shall endure. For Artanis. To me, my swarm! Templar, join us, quickly! We are focused once more. Vorazun, your forces have arrived just in time. Amon has opened a portal to the Void. It must be shut down before it tears us apart. Agreed. My swarm and I will bear the brunt of Amon's power and buy you time. But it's up to you to seal that portal. The Gateway draws power from these Void Crystals. We will need to destroy them if we are to seal the gate. Then it shall be done. Darkness is approaching my hive cluster, Artanis. I hope you're getting ready to disable those crystals. I'll continue sending as many Zerg as I can spare to help you. Fight well, Templar. Olak Natal. Thank you. 
detecting several energy sources hidden across the temple. They appear to be Zell Naga vessels, ancient power sources. If we can locate them, I should be able to use their energy to free up additional solarite from the Spear of Adun's core. My brood is pushing towards a crystal. This crystal's defenders have fallen. Our tanks have your warriors seed to its destruction. The swarm is moving on. Thoughts are clear. I am here in the shadows. Upgrade complete.
crystal destroyed. Sensors are showing three more remain, Hierarch. I heed the call. My forces and I move against a crystal. Thought I might extend an invite your way. Upgrade complete. Enough, my swarm. Pull back. We'll regenerate at the hive cluster. Teleport successful. Upgrade complete. Let our enemy know our fury. Artanis, hurry up and disable those void crystals. My hive cluster is taking a beating. For Artanis, we are focused once more. Teleport successful. Teleport successful. Teleport successful. Teleport successful. Teleport successful. Teleport successful. Swarm. Once they are dead, move on. The Templar will deal with the crystal. Your thoughts are clear. As ever, I serve. Crystals destroyed. I suspect Amon's forces will not let us take the next two so easily. Hybrid are moving to attack our Nexus point. Ready our defenses. My swarm moves against the crystal. Join us, Artanis. can destroy it whenever you are ready. Our spirit is in the Only one remains, and the portal is growing unstable. We must destroy the final crystal, and do so with haste. Hybrid inbound on our nexus point. Warriors, intercept them! Upgrade complete. Our power shall serve. We are focused once more. Secured a Zelna 
Naga Vessel, Carax. Prepare for transfer. Unbelievable. Despite eons of inactivity, these devices are still at full power. Oh. The second Zelnaga power source has been secured. I only detect one energy signal left. Swarm is engaging our enemy. Your Templar are welcome to join in the hunt. Unity through purpose. Let our enemy know our glory. Antaro Tassadar. is the last of the vessels, Carax. Understood. I am transferring the final power source now. Upgrade complete. Let our enemy know Well, this day, Kerrigan. Join us. Together, we can defeat Amon and send him back into the void. My swarm was broken here, Artanis. I'll need time to rebuild my forces. There is no time. My people are being consumed. Their very flesh turned into Amon's own. I cannot wait. Then you must do as I have gather allies, subjugate enemies, do whatever you can. To ensure victory, survival is never pretty. We are very different leaders, but I thank you nonetheless. Until we meet again. Tannis, Hierarch of the Twilight Council, Warlord of the Templar. I had expected so much more. Arrogance! Watch your words, or my blade will watch them for you. Oh, that's hardly a way to speak of one who saved your master's life. You care little for my survival, Alarak. What is the true reason you've come to me? Our god broke his ancient covenant and cast us low. These are lies, Artanis. I am the liar. Are you not but a lie incarnate machine? Prototh. Speak your peace, Alarak. The Talgarim's death fleet amasses its slain, awaiting the start of a full-scale invasion. I come with an offer. You will aid me in invoking a challenge for the right to rule my kind as High Lord. And in return, 
I will grant you a cessation of hostilities between our people. Phoenix, rally my advisors. It appears we have much to discuss. Ah, Artanis. I believe I will serve you more effectively from here. Besides, I would rather Alarak remain where he can be watched. Rohana, do you not see why you must sever your nerve cords? I cannot allow you to fall under Amon's sway again. The Kala was created in our darkest moment. Only its light was able to bind our people to give us unity. We are born into it. And when we die, our spirits become one with it. It is worth fighting for. And now Amon uses it against us. It sustains his existence. Its time must end. Artanis, through the Kala, our every thought and emotion are made as one. I feel his thoughts and emotions swirling like a vortex throughout. He does not realize it, but here, within the Kala, he is vulnerable. How? Just as he can see into me, I can see into him. We can use this to our advantage, Hierarch. I know it. It is not worth it. Please, I only ask for time. It's almost Nothing true. was as it seemed. We came to Almar to awaken the Zelnaga and receive their aid. Instead, Amon nearly killed us. I fear Zeratul's prophecy is no longer clear to me. He was closer to the truth than I thought. The Zelnaga did rest here. Had they lived, I think they would have given us their aid, just as Zeratul said. If nothing else, I will grant him that. Matriarch, your words surprise me. Perhaps your counsel has proved influential in some regards. Then I will endeavor to give you more of it. I said some regards, Hierarch. Not all. Powerful psionic warriors have joined our ranks, Hierarch. You must choose among them. Order me to war. I return. Casa de Templari. de Templari. Hi, Rock. I believe I have found a way to save our people. As Zeratul foresaw, this keystone can indeed be our salvation. Explain yourself. As we have seen, the keystone was designed to be found and assembled by those who would ascend to become Zelnaga. After leading them to Ulnar, it would also expel its stored energy to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. The Keystone siphons energies and redistributes essence, matter, information, consciousness. To this device, they are all the same. I see that now. This is how it cleansed Kerrigan? It extracted the essence that forged her into the Queen of Blades. And then it used that energy to release Amon from the Void. If I can discover how to control the Keystone, we could use it to extract Amon from the Kala and save our people. Then Zeratul has led us to hope after all. Continue your research, Karax. We have a war to take to Amon. You were right all along, Hierarch. I am little more than a clone of your friend, Phoenix. The Calgarine speaks truth. I am synthetic, a replication, a lie. What did you find in the Archive? My death, my rebirth as a Dragoon, and then my death at the hands of this Queen of Blades. I am not Phoenix, 
Yet I hold his memories as if they were my own. I must have time to consider this. You are a warrior, Phoenix. Whether you identify yourself as my old friend or not, know that I believe in you. And I believe you will help me destroy Amon's armies and save our people. Do not waver because of this knowledge. I will try, Hierarch. You must know Amon will destroy you. If you have such faith in him, why are you here? Oh, I merely voice the inevitable. I know the true power of what you face. I said destroy you, not I. I have seen enough. His hubris will be his undoing. It is a flaw I also see in you. <laughs> I believe I like you, Hierarch. Your bravery is commendable. Join me then. Together, we can defeat him. I cannot tether my fate to yours. Hatred does not burn within you as it does in me. You do not see through the agony of knowing all you believed in is a lie, and that your only solace is found in the destruction of your betrayer. No. Amon corrupted my people, and now turns them into a hybrid abomination. My rage burns brighter than a thousand suns, and soon all will see my wrath unleashed. Then this is something I hope to witness. All right. Um. Huh. All right. I think we are going to end this video. And it was a really long one, though. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye.